Number six points out that in 2005, a detailed environmental impact assessment carried out on the site, in accordance with EU and Gibraltar law, found there were no significant transboundary effects. The European Commission has investigated the east side reclamation several times and upheld the results of the environmental impact assessment. The Commission's Director General on Environment ruled in 2014 that it was unable to identify any breach of EU environmental legislation in respect of the east side plot. The government also highlights land reclamation by Spain, particularly around the Algeciras port, has been carried out without the same cross-border notifications and led to significant storm damage in Gibraltar. The Spanish view that Gibraltar is not entitled to territorial waters is also, according to the government, fundamentally flawed in international law. Indeed, it adds, even senior legal advisers to the Spanish Foreign Ministry have argued, upon retirement, that Spain does not have a valid argument in this regard. The government believes it to be a sad reality that whenever elections take place in Spain, Gibraltar becomes a political football for different sectors of Spanish society. This, it claims, often happens with no regard to the accuracy of the comments that are made.